ball again, but it was too close. Second ball. Don't shoot, don't shoot. Oh shoot! Oh shoot! Oh my god! Ladies and gentlemen, it's match day. If there's one game that epitomizes the Premier League, it's Arsenal versus Manchester United. From Roy Keane versus Patrick Vieira to Sir Alex Ferguson versus Arsene Wenger, this game has always meant more. So what do you get when you put these two giants of world football, three points apart in the Premier League, dangle the carrot of Champions League football and say, hey, who wants this more? Hopefully, yet another classic. Outside the Emirates, the atmosphere is building. A little transfer news, Gabriel Jesus has been linked to Arsenal as well. We'll ask some fans about that and their match predictions. Let's go. I'm kicking it bro, I'm excited bro. Home, we're at the Emirates and you know what, we're going to give these United lot. Saka is coming out, Saka versus Tellers, they're going to be scared today. I'm going 2-1 to the Gunners, I think we're going to concede, Ronaldo always gets his goal, but you know what, Saka and Eddie and Ketty are going to bag for us today. You, I remember I said it. Gabriel Jesus. Take him Arsenal? No, I, I'm okay with Gabriel Jesus. I'll take Gabriel Jesus. I think we need to stop sticking our nose up with these players. Premier League proven, 25 years old. And uh, if he comes in, guarantee someone else is going to come in, uh, in, my, in my belief. He's not going to be the only option. 3-1 uh, prediction. 3-1. Yeah, Anything. Yeah, other than a win, I won't be happy. Gabriel Jesus, take him at Arsenal or not? Yeah, 25 million. So it's a steal. Yeah, but you can score goals. Premier League proven. A late run upstairs, mate. This is the cardio I need. One, one, two. I'm up here. No speed seats. But in a game like this, you simply have to be in the stadium. What a day for it. We are high up today, lads. We're in the gods today. We're so high up today. And there's no one behind me, basically. There's no seats behind me, at least. Let's go. Here we go, lads. Here we go, here we go. It's a 4 3 2 1 formation. Xhaka El Neni close together in the midfield. I like what I see. This is basically a tactical review at this point. Formations, pressing, tactics. I like it, I like it. I'm getting used to it. We've got to score an early goal, lads. And it goes. Oh, all the way to Saka! Bukayo! Bukayo! Martin Odegaard, like, there we go, Cedric, Martin, what have we got to offer lads, it's Odegaard, I'll be honest, so far, our pressing hasn't been good, at all, it's been too easy for United to play through, the structure's not as typical best, and we haven't got ESR in the game either, yeah, we've got a look at Eiffel at these two, Tellez and Saka, get the switch on, here's Tavares, 
Switch it over to the side. Oh, that's oh cool. That's so cool. That? that is so cool. We're so technically insecure right now. And there goes Sancho. Sancho, so much time. Cheer on Sancho. Great challenge there. Cedric Suarez recovery. We scored, but we've not been good at all. Now we keep giving the ball away. We keep making silly errors. And right now they've hit the ball from the long shot. We cannot keep doing this. Pick up on a second. El Neni. Oh, is Akeya onside? Akeya! And he was onside. Saka. Odegaard. Oh! Akeya! It's a goal! Shot! It's gone again! It's gone again! Let's go! Checking a possible off flag, but I'm sure Saka was fouled anyway. So then, is it a penalty? So I think it's offside. We're probably going to get a penalty. He's going to go check the penalty. So we've not scored, but but it's a penalty. Surely. Exactly. If the referee's going, that means it's a penalty. And it's uh, Bukayo Saka. Bukayo, Bukayo, Bukayo. Last time I watched him take a penalty, I was at the Euros final. What's gonna happen this time? Oh, Bukayo. Nerves are still, lad. Gabriel's head, lad. Oh, oh, nearly. Saka! Oh, block Saka! Oh! Block him to North Bank track. End to end, lads. Every time we actually go forward and play some good football, we, we rip them apart. But we've not done enough. It's like almost we're taking the game for granted. Off the fans blowing for the whistle. Kind of sums it up. Please, please. There we go. Oh my god. Half time. Two one to the odds. We've not been good. Let's let's get that straight. Every time we've gone forward, we've caused issues, but it's not been enough for us. This is at home, this is at the Emirates, United are out of four. And we should be dominating this game. And with Nenny and Jaka numbered. Ramsdale has been awful with his feet, Ben White and Gabriel nervous, and Cedric as well. Tavares has tried but not good either. Every time we go forwards, we just show how poor a team United are. But unfortunately, we're too technically insecure to get the ball into the final third. I guess we could say the Ronaldo goal is out of the way. He's got his hundred, I knew he was going to score it, but he's out of the way. Second half, as long as we go back to our normal selves, maybe bring on Tommy Asu, it should be a comfortable win. Right, out for the second half. But no subs. I thought Tommy Asu was going to come on. Anyone, if uh, anyone wants to join me at the Emirates, I've got one, two, three, four, five, six seats just uh, here. 
Comment below if you want to join your boy. Cedric vs Santos in this match. <laughs> Big mismatch. It's violent. Yeah, another United corner. And again, it's Jadon Sancho causing the issues. One all season, lads. One all season they've scored and they're going to... No, no, no. Here we go. Oh, penalty. Look at that. Look at us. And we have been awful as well. It's a club. So bipolar. We give you hope, they take it. We give you hope, they take it. Tavares handball. Mm. And Bruno Fernandez is most definitely going to score this. I can't lie, I don't see how Ramsdale saves this. Fernandez likes to take penalties. Mm. And he's normally pretty decent. It's all quiet. I've seen enough, right? Cedric Suarez, to right, is getting ripped. Bring on Yasu. Bring on Tommy. Oh, Cedric. Oh, Cedric. Oh, Cedric. Oh. Ronaldo, offside, offside, offside. This club, man. It's not going to pay hard. It's just not. Throw was pretty abject in the game to be fair, so I can understand that. But I wanted to Tommy Asu. I know I don't know how I don't know how fit he is. But we need to see him. We need to Tommy Asu. Because that's the big issue. Cedric versus Sancho is complete and out of this match. Oh my god. And there's a fight, there's a fight! There's a fight. The big fight! Big big fight! I think it's Gabriel involved. Wrestling match, mate. WWE. Oh, lovely Odegaard. More like it. Saka onside. I want to handball again, but it was too close. Second ball. Don't shoot. Don't shoot. Oh shoot! Oh shoot! Oh my God! Finally gonna get it. Here he is. Do I see Mr. Takahiro after three months out? Here he is. And Suarez can walk off nice and slowly. Oh, how I have missed you, Tommy. A roar from the Arsenal fans. Okay, I'm in the cast right now. Big Arsenal fan from India. Yeah. What are your thoughts on the game, my friend? It was my like last game over here. I'm going back to India. What a game it was. 3 1 to the Arsenal. And Tommy Asu is back again. Odegaard, silky smooth. 
No, that is not say clue though. I honestly don't have a clue what to make to that, about that game. I need time to process that. I don't know, man. It's like the fullbacks are very concerning. I'm not gonna lie about that. I think Tavares, Cedric, they're not secure enough. Tommy Ash is back. Got some minutes towards the end. But it indicates that hopefully he's gonna be fit for the next game against West Ham. Yay! at the back. Come in, attack. I'm buzzing with the three points and I'm buzzing. A uh, very tough game to be honest, a lot harder than I anticipated but first 50, to be honest that we scored early on but I didn't think we were too great early on. I thought that transition ball in behind was always on. Ronaldo was really really good today. So I'm, I'm optimistic for sure and we just got to do the basic job really, get a point against Spurs and hopefully, it, hopefully it's there. Alright, first of all, I'll be from Toronto, Canada. Thoughts of the game? Speechless man, speechless. Like, I love the way everyone played. First of all, um, just I don't know the atmosphere was amazing. It was just you just felt after the first goal. I just felt I just felt confident the way we were playing. One of those games, man. You, you win, you win. You're happy. I'll analyze it. I'll break it down. The five things you learn. But I hope you guys have enjoyed this vlog as always. Hopefully, I have more until the end of the season. If you do enjoy this content, smash a like as always. Subscribe to the thing if you are new on the road to 90,000 subscribers. I can't thank you guys enough for that. Comment below your thoughts. See you guys later on the five things you learn. Love it.